my name is Brenda McCray. I am 51 years old. I am the mother of two, 33-year-old and a 16-year-old. I've been married for 18 years and I reside in Evans, Georgia. I was diagnosed with ductal invasive carcinoma cancer in my right breast. It measured 3.3 centimeters when I had my surgery. June 3rd, I went to the radiation department. I was then um, given a mammogram and the radiologist came back out and told me that I was positive for cancer. My diagnosis of cancer has led me to take things more seriously, led me to wash my hands more frequently, led me to be more careful about who I'm around or who my daughter's around or who my family's around. It has led me to just look at other people and observe them more and to basically just take more um, precautionary actions such as keeping hand sanitizers everywhere in the house, keeping disinfectant wipes everywhere in the house. Um, it has even prompted me to work from home allow my daughter to school from home, and my husband is also working from home. After seeing the statistics and the percentage of people who were affected by COVID, I spoke to my oncologist, I spoke to my surgeon, I spoke to my primary care, I spoke to my radiologist. All of them 100% agreed that I was very vulnerable to catch COVID. If I caught COVID during the time of my treatment, or within the time frame of my treatment, I, my body could not take that blow. My immune system is still low from chemotherapy wiping out all of my good white blood cells and I'm still building my immune system. If I was to contract COVID, my chances would be grim. So I have decided to work from home until COVID has subsided. COVID is real. And I get upset when seeing people not taking their own lives serious enough to wear their mask. We have to make sure that we're taking care of our families, our friends, our children, and let them know that life is good, life is what you make it, and we need to live for today. What a time to live.